Roddy, what's it like being back here, uh, seeing all the turnout and everything? And just uh, it feels good, man. It feels really good. Um, watching a little 707 drill red zone right now. So, you know, it's getting good, man. I'm glad everybody came out. You know, we're going to have a good time watching these guys. And I'm just happy the program's back, you know, overall. And uh, people are out here and, and, su and supporting it. And, um, you know, we're going to get better each and every year and try to uh, get our program back to where it used to be. As you watched from Atlanta, did you ever think this day would actually come? Yes, 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 yes. I've been in contact with, with the AD and, um, you know, Coach Clark and everything. So, um, you know, um, they were trying and, 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 and pushing and moving and, and trying to get the program back and, you know, talking to a lot of good people around the, um, around the community and, you know, getting help from everybody. So, you know, they were headed in the right direction a long time ago. So uh, we knew it was going to get back. We just wanted to uh, make sure everybody was on the same page and uh, get rolling and do it the right way. It's got to be tough. I imagine it got to be tough leaving Atlanta after the run you had. Yeah, yeah, it's a little tough. You know, it's always tough when you spend, you know, your whole career someplace and then you uh, you have to find a new home. So, um, you know, that was, tough. That was a tough situation. But you know, I've moved on and um, I'm enjoying my time at UAB today. And then, you know, next week I'll start, you know, start my journey and, and start going, getting ready, you know, to play for another team. What are you interest? Um, I mean, me and my agent have been talking to a lot of people and, and things like that, but, you know, it's, it's such a long process, man, from this point on. So um, we're just going to continue to just go through the calls and stuff like that and then move forward. What do you want to – what are you looking for in your next team? Oh, man, I want to win. <laughs> you know, um, I played 11 years. This will be my 12th coming up. And, um, you know, I want to play for a team that's, that's, that's going to win Super Bowl. You know, that's what I want to do. How much longer do you feel like you have in the league? Man, I could play forever, man. What you talking <laughs> about, man? You know what I'm saying? <laughs> no, 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 man. I, I don't know. To tell you the truth, I don't like putting numbers on things because uh, a long time ago I said I'm going to play eight years in the NFL, then I got to 10, you know, and I, I knew I wasn't going to go past 10. Now, this will be 12 if I get on with another team. So, you know, you never you never, you never punch the clock. You know, you never, never tell somebody that you don't want to play no more because then you might not get a job. <laughs> Is it, I mean, I'm sure you've been, you've, you've had this uh, for a while, but is it one of those things where you feel like you're the, I mean, you really are the guy representing UAB at the NFL level? Do you just feel a sense of responsibility with that? And, and are, how much are you aware of that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I totally do because, um, you know, I always tell people where I went to school and things like that. And, you know, shout out, you know, UAB and things like that. So it's good, man. And that's why I got to stay in the league, you know, because if I'm out of the league, then we won't have that many more representatives, you know what I'm saying? But, um, you know, I got to keep it going. And um, hopefully we can get some other guys in there that can be successful and, and make it to a couple of Pro Bowls and, and, and be all pro and just continue to, uh, to reign. We good? Good, good.